Mousy sides. Uh, what exactly is going on here? We were trying some wizarding for Kate, Tertia. This Kate? Oh, no. It's the human girl, Kate. Oh, the one who lives uh, in this room, Kate? She's scared to go to her new school, so we're helping her. It doesn't look like help to me. It's just Dreamy has spilled her dream by mistake. <gasps> uh-uh. No way was it by mistake. Someone made me do it. What do you mean? This is what I mean. For September 1st, I decided I wanted to give Kate a good dream for school. If you dream good, your mood is good, right? I gathered all her favorite fairy tale heroes, added some surprise twists here and there, and then some laughter. But as I was putting the dream under her pillow, there appeared those pink balls. Ferrum, scarum. That was all you're doing, Esty. Why me? I didn't mean it. You know that. No, they did it themselves. Who needs those dreams of yours? Girls only need pretty dresses. And I thought if her dress was sparkly, then she wouldn't be afraid to go to a new school anymore. It was a sight for sore eyes, to say the least. But then, the sun struck the mirror in the powder case. And it was all Letty's fault. Hmm. Letty, you say? Finally, now I can tell you in order what really happened. We decided to help Kate. We didn't agree on what was more important. Dreamy said it was dreams. Esty said it was clothes. But I believe the main thing is knowledge. So I decided to prepare a vitamin cocktail for Kate. I found a very scientific recipe to make thinking active and memory and attention stronger to help perform better in school. So I got all of the ingredients together and had to only gather some sunlight in a jar. That was the last stage. Suddenly... Ah! Oh, what a mess! Fenty's wild book had to spoil it all. It's all your unscientific nonsense. It's not nonsense. It was sad. Sad? What was? The book. I wanted to get Kate's things ready. Make them all sweet. Let's go. On to school now. Be a faithful tool now. Yep. <gasps> Aww. Aww. You poor one. You're so alone. Aww. Don't worry. We'll make you happy. Letty, Esty, Dreamy. Let's play dino. Sorry. I don't you have time. Now. That's all right. We'll just have fun without them. No big deal. Hey, what's wrong? to ruin everything on purpose. It just ended up that way. It always just happens with you. What will become of my cocktail now? And how about my dress? And my dream? There you go again with your nonsense. The knowledge. No one needs your knowledge. <gasps> what do they need then? Your what pictures? Oh. That is quite a tornado. Ugh. So what shall I do with this now? It looks like we're going to have to check the emo meter. <laughs> I wonder, is it due to the dull weather? <laughs> uh, mm. Oh no, my wings! They seem to have disappeared! What did you expect? Magic needs good emotional conditions to work correctly. Huh. Do you see what's happened because of it? Doom and gloom. Yes, we shouldn't leave it like this. What will happen when the humans come back? It's not our fault. The barometer has pointed to bad weather since this morning. Of course it has. The human girl is afraid to go to her new school. What? This is why it all turned murky, but you... But we made it even worse. It's all Letty's fault. She always bosses us around. In fact, Dreamy is the oldest, oh, and she... Oh, I see. Yes, when yes, you yes, need someone responsible, you I'm the eldest. No, but when... it was all really my fault. Mm hmm So it was all Fanti's fault, right? No, it's not true. Fancy asked us for help, and we... What are we? <laughs> Some lame trolls here who are out for themselves? We're not trolls. We're fairies. We're no fairies. <laughs> We're trolls. <gasps> <gasps> Dreamy, enough of that. Stop. All right, time's up. So are you ready to put everything back in place? Um... Oh, we're ready! That's great to hear. Oh. Ooh.
Everything is upside down. We can tell feet from the ground. It's all in her love for Lou and Ro. We're all in each other's way, and we keep making mistakes. But when we stop fighting, we can conquer great heights. Why is this so topsy turvy now? For the power Or the numbers on your phone Perhaps a pedal in a butt I think not If we put our strengths together We will see success forever Everything will fall right into place But the math is really easy And there is a simple law And it's for a real good reason They made it up so we'll follow If you wanna make it wonderful You do everything together Proper place. Lady Clockwork will be very pleased. Who was she anyway? Well, you should have asked well? for that right from the beginning, girls. Don't you think? How come you listen to a clockwork lady, yet you don't even know who I am? <sighs> My name is Terpsy Hooray, Eve Roll Gardenia Ciercila. Yes, I am. Whoa. No thanks. I don't need it. <laughs> oh, how very fantastic. Oh, wow. Tur uh? Tertia. I don't mean the name. What are you to us? I will be your new tutoress. Uh, I'll be in charge of your uh, education as of today. Eating? Yes, <gasps> eating too. And sweets are only after supper. Okay, mm. but where's Granny yeah, though? Yeah, she was our tutor before. Uh, granny? <laughs> oh no, the humans are coming. <gasps> huh? Home, quickly, let's go. Starting tomorrow, we'll start our training at nine sharp. Now we'll have everything timed by a clock. Oh, well, that was an unexpected twist. But still, it was a good idea to call myself a teacher. Tertia, Tertia, what about a fairy tale? Uh, I'm in bed already. Fairy tales for you as well? Do I even know of any? Yes, Fanti, I'm coming. Katie, how did your first day go? Oh, the teacher complimented me for giving a good answer. And my new uniform is so nice and comfy. I love <laughs> it! Hooray! The dinosaur book came in handy for the lesson, too. Everything was just great. I even had a good dream that helped me. The one about horsey corns. <gasps> Yay! <laughs> Everything's in place now. The prophecy has started to come true. The spilled dream, the overfilling sunlight, pink balls, and the book coming alive. Hmm, but what exactly does this symbol mean? Hmm. Unnecessary words. Say what? Kate is crying, quarreling with her parents. And even screaming. 
What's wrong with her? We don't know. But um... it's so easy to understand. It's because of freckles. Freckles are so important. No, Kate's shoes are tight. She said it herself. Well, in my opinion, it's about grades. They're getting worse and worse. Grades, trades. Maybe Kate has an unhappy love. Okay, enough discussion. I'll help with Kate's studies. Fancy with shoes, Esty with freckles, and dreamy. And I will make a great dream for Kate. We'll rock it. Her mood will skyrocket up. Hooray! Super helpers, rush to help Kate. Zoom! Here, Katie baby. I will sprinkle my powder on your pillow, and you will not have a single freckle left. You will be pretty, pretty. Uh, toys, friends, cakes. Eclairs. Wait, not at all. No eclairs. Buns. Like this. Yes. And that's all. Exercise we do together. Pull the insoles and socks together. Put your weight on your heel. Now to our muff is a deal. Let the textbook tell all the lessons and explain in great detail their essence. <gasps> Who's there? <gasps> hey, who are you? Come on, show yourself. Fly? Cockroach? Spider? Where are you from? What are you doing? Oh, hey. Let go! Wait, wait! I'm talking to you! Save yourselves if you can! If you cannot, still save yourselves! So that's what you are! Katie, Dusty, Dreamy, grab them! Catch them! Hold on! I'm in pursuit! Who are we hunting, Letter? I don't know who they are, but they're very suspicious. Help! I got it! I got I it! Hide. I'm holding it! <laughs> oh, I don't have it anymore! <laughs> it seems to me that these are creatures from the night world! They're so fast! <gasps> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Aha! Gotcha! Confess! What do you want here? Are you evildoers? Who sent you? We won't let you harm our girl! Oh, how ghastly! Little things! Tell us who you are. I know you are good, not harmful doers at all. I'm Gobbledygook. Gobble up who now? Alpha Pulverons. Daguerreotype. Rhymant. Who, who, who? We are words, unnecessary, rare, forgotten. People don't use us, and they abandoned us. Letter, why did you send us to chase them? Unnecessary words are what they are, unnecessary. Hmm, yeah. It looks like they're having nothing to do with what's going on. I'll go polish the buttons on Kate's dress. Poor things. Nobody needs you. But I need you. Truer than true. Fancy, have you forgotten about Kate's shoes? Oh, I will go now. We will play with you later. Kate, are you already home? How was your day? All is bad. What all is bad? In general, everything. These stupid shoes fall off my feet. I almost lost them. My freckles are gone. And I only like them on my stupid face. And Claire hasn't written to me for two weeks. And nobody ever writes a line to me. I really want one. And I, and I haven't become a great scientist yet. <laughs> uh, okay, I have to train for the repelling huh? spell. Exactly. 
Exactly. Soon Tertia will return. I'll go and nail down something too, or she will cling on to me like a leech again. Very wary. Letter, look! Kate's phone. Let's take a look, huh? Somehow, this is not good. Come on, Letter. We're here to help. Come, you can see for yourself. It's about to bang. We'll have a typhoon here with special effects. Okay, let's do it. This program will scan her phone and analyze all messages and searches. See the most frequent search query. What if no one loves you and everyone just scolds you? Wow. Hello, kids. Here I am. You are so good. Very nice. Only our names are terribly complicated. Let's tell our names again. I am Fanti. I am Gobbledygook. Daggerotype. <laughs> Raymond. Well done. And you have done well. I love you. I love you too. Oh, wait. Are those actually your names? Kitty. Sweetheart. Our pride. Little bird. But how can the words, I love you, and well done, not be needed? They are really necessary. Good girl. Disket. Sweetheart. Corporons. Beauty. My treasure. Kiddo. Sweet pea. Primus. Oh, wait, wait. I can't deal with this alone. Dreamy, Letty, Esty. I compared everything and came to a conclusion. Parents stopped saying good words to Kate. And that is why she thinks that nobody needs her. But they really love her very much. People feel so bad without you, especially Kate. And it'll be closed curtains for us. All right, guys, you had a good run so far. You have to come back. But we cannot return by ourselves. People need to hear or read us. Not necessary. Here, people just forgot about you and we will help them remember. We will post you here and here. <laughs> like this. Opa! <laughs> and you will go here. And you come here and here. Letty is in touch, over. I can hear you very well. <laughs> Hooray, all done. <laughs> Hey, everything is ready. Let's have dinner. Oh, I forgot the bread. I was staring at my little Kate. What a beautiful girl you are. And what a clever girl. We are proud of you, Kitty. <laughs> Mommy, Daddy, I love you so much. And we love you so much. Gobbledygook. Whoa! Oh. I think I got the word wrong a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> was it my... I mean, our plan was great, huh? You right, girls? And I know how to return freckles. <laughs> Record a voice message. Listen, why are you lost? I... well, this is... in general, well, like... I uh, miss you. Hey! Shoot! Oh, huh. Oh, Dreamy, it is you. It's great that you called. I miss you two. I'll be there in five minutes. Fantastic, Dreamy. I'm so happy for you. You're so pretty, such a cutie. So interesting me, you. Come on, what are you saying? A cutie? Interestingly me? Sure. Well, it's... I don't know, you know? <laughs> Gobbledygook is a wordy and generally unintelligible jargon, usually hard to understand. Gobbledygook. It's easy. Daggerotype is an old photograph on a metal plate. Pulverones are shortbread cookies. I bet they're very necessary words. Magic mirror for Esty. <laughs> <laughs> Me 
hurry up. <laughs> <laughs> Here I am. Absolutely no one pays attention to me. All the girls have their friends. Dreamy has a Claire. Lottie has Digit. Even Fancy has a friend. Chest and me. Look, I need right. Hmm. Who better to ask for advice? Distinguished fairy granny, are you playing hide and seek with me? Try what you want, but I will find oh, you anyway. Turns you, turns you. Could you tell me what you think? If someone gets this cute haircut here in the magazine, or I mean me, uh, and nice bangs too, and a pretty dress like that. But a little tighter here, and maybe a little shorter to fit yes, better. Yes, yes, yes. It'll suit you very much. Huh? But this is the wrong page. There was... Sorry, SD. I'm very, very busy. Uh, hmm. hmm. And what is Tertia up to? I wish we could read her mind. But don't overshoot this time. How's that? <laughs> Last time I accidentally read Kate's mind instead of Tertia's. <laughs> Lucky it wasn't Booty's mind. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, why don't we... Huh, why don't we sneak into Tertia's house and find out everything? It's dangerous, and we mustn't break the Fairyland's law of inviolability of the Did home. You're such a bore. Uh -huh. That's a great idea. We'll open the secret door, and there we'll find something. Hey, what do you think of this, guys? Will this pretty dress suit me? Well with it too? Or not exactly this, uh, but perhaps... This is a really bad time, Esty. Dreamy, could you do it one more time? I only just wanted to ask for your advice, but if you're so busy... <laughs> Hooray! Oh, they're so funny to play with. Thanks a lot, Chesty. Esty, are you sad? What happened? Nothing. Chesty. Do you think you can give a present to Esty? I want to unsadden her. <gasps> oh, can you please? Something that will make me the most beautiful girl. Huh? Huh? A mirror? Oh, a magic mirror. Wow, maybe we can use it to make magic sun puddles. <gasps> this is the mirror from a fairy tale. Huh? me, please, if I'm, um, good-looking. Oh, I'm doing it all wrong. Who is the fairest of them all? You are 15% beautiful. Who is the fairest of them all? You are 15% beautiful. Oh, you mean me? Me, a fairy of beauty, is only 15% We can take Fancy's invisibility cloak. We'll all cover ourselves with it, and Tertia won't even notice us. <laughs> That's easy enough. Lighty, can you take a look? I don't think it's working right. <gasps> I have a... No way. A magic mirror? Fair of Scarum. I thought it existed only in fairy tales. <laughs> Who is the fairest of them all? You are 16% <laughs> beautiful. Ah! <laughs> 16%? And I'm 15%? Esty, you should show it to Tertia. Oh, you're right. If the mirror is working okay, Tertia will be 100% beautiful. Or 150%. Fairy Granny, don't you test my patience. Tertia, Tertia, could you have a look, please? The mirror says I'm only 15% beautiful, but that can't be, can it? Esty, looks don't matter. A decent fairy... But what mirror do you mean? The magic one from a fairy tale. Chessie gave it to me. Hmm. Let me see about this. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest of them all? You are 15% beautiful. Hmm. Seems I have to deal with it. Ouch, you stepped on my foot. No, I didn't step on anything. you too. Look here. 
The illusion frame. Why does Tertia need it? Whoa. What foolish piece of glass? You're useless. The latest update is available. The Epoch of Fairy Agraria <gasps> to upgrade. That was about 500 years ago. So that's what the problem is. The database is outdated. Of course, updated. Pretty little mirror upgrade. Fainet connection is required. That's strange. It seems everything is in place. Hmm. Well, that's much safer. The update has been installed. Uh -huh. If you would like to receive notification... You can tell me, am I beautiful? True beauty is a harmonious combination of positive personal qualities. A fairy can be considered beautiful if she is kind, soft-hearted... Magic and... mirror, answer me! Who's the fairy of the ball? Me? Or maybe I need bangs? Is that cover fairy hat? Skills, abilities, and knowledge that are necessary for a harmonious personality. Music, painting, psychology, exact sciences, literature. <gasps> and I need all that to be beautiful? And there's no way around it? <gasps> I don't even know where to start. Iliad. Homer. So I'll become more beautiful if I read this? Maybe it's better to cut my bangs. Phew! Harry fairies, another second and Tertia would have caught us. We'd have told her that we confused the door. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Esty, what happened? Daddy, now I finally know why nobody loves me. That's because I'm not truly beautiful. And to become beautiful, I have to study all of these. Oh, and I need to read the whole Iliad. <laughs> you are very beautiful, and we all love you. Yeah, Esty, you're such a cool girl. You are such a beauty that it's music to my ears. Yeah, yeah, you're really wow. <laughs> you're all right, sweetie. Really? But anyway, I've made up my mind. I'll do everything on the list of this stupid, useless mirror, so I'll become such a beauty! Esty, the mirror is not useless. It's actually very useful. While you were distracting Tertia with the mirror, we sneaked into her house. Into Tertia's house? And what's there? Shh, not here. I told you that I would find you anyway. Swing open doors, move apart walls. Fairy Granny, tell me, what are you doing? I am a fairy of coziness, but I am not a helpless creature either. I'll get out of here and tell everyone that you're an imposter. Let me out immediately. Oh, poor girls. But Granny, you yourself agreed to take a little vacation somewhere in uh... nature. Would you like to rest in the ocean? To swim with some turtles? I've had enough of swimming. With dolphins, with whales, and with turtles, too. I'm tired of them all. One of them even bit me. I want to go home. And what about mountains? Meadows blooming with flowers. Hospitable dwarves. Chocolate made of alpine milk. Chocolate? Well, maybe only for a couple of days, but then... Oh, it won't take too long, I promise. I need chocolate with nuts. Yes, with the best nuts in the world. Have a great weekend, dear fairy granny. <laughs> What's the matter now? Who is the fairest of them all? True beauty is a harmonious combination of positive personal qualities. Oh, of qualities. course. All according to the precepts of Shimmer Fairy. A true fairy must. Don't tell me to go through a spiral labyrinth. Member, no matter what the problem a is. spiral labyrinth. But what if this is the spiral magic I was looking for all along? 